My dad is awesome. Hey guys, it's me again, Douglas, and today I wanted to talk to you guys about Father's Day. I wanted to talk to you about our dads. And my dad is amazing. I love him so much. He does so much for me and for my family. He's always there for me to talk to and he he teaches me so many new things and he helps me to be brave and he helps me to be a better person. And you know what's cool is that God uses our dads to kind of show us what he is like. Yeah, now our dads are not perfect and God is perfect. But the love that our dads have for us can help us to understand God's love for us. You know, like every Sunday my dad makes us a big, nice breakfast before we go to church. And some days it's eggs and bacon, and sometimes it's pancakes or French toast or or other tasty breakfast foods. And if I went to my dad and I said, hey, dad, can we have eggs this morning? He's not going to give me a plate of pinching, stinging scorpions. No, because he loves me and he, he wants what's best for me. And God loves us the same way our dads love us, and even more so. And actually, did you know that God is your heavenly father? Because like, first of all, you know, like he made everybody and everything. So he's our father in that sense. We are his children in that sense. But even more specifically than that, the Bible says that if you believe in Jesus Christ, then you will be adopted into God's family. And when Jesus' disciples asked him how they should pray, he told them that they should start by saying, our father, talking to God. God is our heavenly father. And our earthly fathers can help us to better understand our heavenly father. You know, like my dad, he, he teaches me about God, specifically teaches me about God. You know, like he reads the Bible and he, he tells me who God is. But even just by his actions, he shows me who God is. The love of my father helps me to better understand the love of my heavenly father. And again, dads aren't perfect. But the way that our dads teach us and take care of us and listen to us and want what's best for us and help us to be strong, those are all things that God does, even more so. And you know, Father's Day can be kind of a hard time for some people because maybe their dads aren't around, or maybe their dads aren't very good dads. And that can be really sad. But no matter what kind of dad your dad is, you have a loving, heavenly father who cares about you very, very much. And so if your dad helps you to see the love of God, I hope that you will go to your dad and you will thank him for all the many ways that he has shown God's love to you. And no matter what, I hope that you will thank God for being a good dad good father because our heavenly father loves us and he wants what's best for us and he's always there for us he is our good good father hey guys i hope you like this video and hey happy father's day yeah i hope that you will find a way to show your dad how much he means to you and that you'll thank god for being your heavenly father and if your dad isn't around i want you to look for another godly man in your life who has been there for you? Who's someone who has shown you God's love? And they might not be your actual, you know, like real dad, but if there's a man in your life who has shown you God's love, I want you to go and thank them. Being a dad can be really hard. And so on this Father's Day, I hope that you will thank the father figure in your life for showing you God's love.